A Rutherford County man has been charged here in Catawba County with counts including conspiracy and possession of stolen goods. He was arrested last week and remained in jail as of earlier today. 24 year old Joshua Adam Price of the Rutherford County town of Ellenboro was arrested last Thursday by Conover police. He's charged with conspiracy to commit felony larceny, possession of stolen goods or property, injury to property to obtain non-ferrous metal, larceny of motor vehicle parts, misdemeanor probation violation, and second degree trespassing. Price is also charged with 11 counts of failure to appear on various highway violation infractions. Price was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $20,000 bond. District court appearances were scheduled yesterday and today along with May 16th, May 20th and June 6th. 38 year old Josh Lee Bricky of Browns Chapel Road in Catawba was arrested Saturday by Catawba County Sheriff's officers. He's charged with felony possession of Schedule 1 controlled substance, possession of drug paraphernalia, and failure to appear in court on account of possession of drug paraphernalia. Bricky was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility following the arrest under $6,000 bond. He remained in jail as of earlier today. District court dates are scheduled for May 26th and June 9th. The next suspect is a Newton woman who is charged with having drugs at a jail. 32 year old Brandy Nicole Childers of Wyoming Street in Newton was arrested last Thursday by Newton police. She's charged with felony conspiracy, possession of controlled substance in jail or prison, and simple possession of Schedule 3 controlled substance. Childers was incarcerated in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $2,500 bond. She's no longer listed as an inmate. A district court date was scheduled yesterday. 27 year old Ashley Marie Hullett of Helton Road in Granite Falls was arrested yesterday by Hickory Police. She's charged with felony possession of Schedule 2 controlled substance. Hullett was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility following the arrest under $1,000 bond and remained in jail as of earlier today. A district court date is set for May 30th. Reporting from Catawba County, I'm Rob Eastwood, WHKY-TV News.